Welcome to Celebrating Act 2. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life. Hey, everybody. Good to see you again. Thanks for joining us on Celebrating Act 2 for our founder's blog, blog, whatever it is. It's, it's where Art and I get to uh, wax poetic every week. Oh, right, yeah. Art? Wax on, yeah. wax off. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, John? Uh, hey, yeah, how you doing, people? How you nice doing, way, peoples out there? It's this is a nice way, a nicer way of saying BS. Oh uh, yeah, great. It, so, so, but we're not doing Brazilian wax today, right? No. Today okay, so everybody's safe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so today we we have something interesting and not BS to talk about. You just went to a. Um, a weekend celebration for Vince McCullough. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Who's, who's uh, if you watch uh, Celebrating Act Two, you've probably seen his videos uh, about Tai Chi. And uh, he's, of course, a longtime coach, Tai Chi coach for you. Right. Uh, and lots of other people, yeah. thousands of people. Um, so how was it? You, you went to the beach? Well, it you? was terrific. So uh, first of all, there were a lot of people helping to organize it. And... Um, uh, most everybody here wouldn't know them, but uh, Ron and Pavla and Davida and Karen and Jim were sort of, for anybody who knows all of us, were really the driving forces of this. I get a lot of credit for it, but I'm just the journalist. I just got the information out. Uh, yeah. Of course, I've been sort of like the videographer and the photographer and, right. uh, and the journalist of, of our group for about uh, a dozen years, so I get a lot of credit even though they do all the work. Uh, sure. Well, you put you put Vince on video. I did. Uh, both the the uh, documentary about uh, Gupa, right? Um, as his grandkids which call is, it. Which will also, on, by the know, way, which will live on our Act website forever. So if you go to the YouTube, uh, yeah. our YouTube channel, Celebrating Act Two, and you type in Gupa or Vince McCullough, you'll see a whole series of things about him. But uh, uh, but anybody who loves a teacher who made a big influence in their life. Vince was that kind of teacher. Right. And in now, fact, we were lucky. Uh, uh, I, I sat down with him and I said, talk. And I put a mic on him and a camera. And that was the beginning of this Gupa. And it has a fascinating backstory. And he was talking about all the things and how he wound up as, uh, even though he was a, a football coach uh, and a kinesiology teacher, how he right. wind up adopting yoga and then Tai Chi. Uh, uh, maybe 35 years ago, and uh, that's sort of been his focus for the, until he passed uh, at the age of 90, just a few yeah, weeks ago. I, and I'm I'm glad to say that uh, I got to meet uh, Vince about five years ago through you, and we did a little video with him. And because of that, we've introduced Vince McCullough to as a teacher, Tai Chi uh, teacher, um, introduced him to thousands of more new people who watch him online so mm -hmm. by, the, uh, by the way just as a couple of notes so uh, we uh, this past sunday uh, we met at 7 a.m which was where we would meet vince uh, uh normally about a, a, a dozen to 15 20 of us would meet every sunday he actually practiced at the beach almost every day of uh of the last 30 years uh that he wasn't traveling and uh, we would meet at 7 a.m and we would practice tai chi for an hour uh, at Aliso Creek Beach, and then uh, oftentimes go out either for a cup of coffee and a, uh, a snack or, or for breakfast uh, after that. And that was sort of what the routine was. But so, And is that what you did on Sunday? So what we did on Sunday was uh, we met at 7, and we did some advertising. We got about, uh, I would say, it could be higher than that, but at least 60 people uh, showed up. Uh, some from as far away as uh, New Mexico, uh, wow. who drove in specifically for that. Uh, we had one person who was watching on FaceTime through a husband from Russia. Uh, so uh, uh, another devoted student of his and really has learned it quite well, Tatjana. And um, uh, probably about seven or eight of his uh, students who became teachers as well. So wow. that's sort of everybody got a chance to lead portions of it. We did all his famous uh, f favorite routines uh, and we had uh, 
pictures galore on on uh, uh, poster board and places for people to sign books. And we announced that there is going to be a bench in his honor at uh, Saddleback College uh, oh, nice. at, with a plaque, and not only to him, but to his wife, Leah, who also taught for many years. And she's still uh, oh, with us, great. thankfully, and a, a good friend. And, nice. and so uh, we'll put a, actually a link in the YouTube video where people could, they want to make a donation if they knew him uh, besides this, or just uh, as a remarkable teacher, if they wanted to you know, just give sure. 20, 30 bucks. Uh, yeah. and didn't know him, but want to recognize a, a teacher. So we'll put that in the, uh, in the uh, uh, description down below. But it was a great time. Uh, uh, we, uh, we goofed up enough because uh, he, he was always playful. And um, at the very end, uh, one of the things I was able to uh, uh, say there was that, because uh, he had a habit of saying to every class, you are my favorite class oh. and you're my favorite people. But the, the <laughs> truth of the matter is that he meant it because he was always present and in the moment. And uh, this is just a number of, of people celebrating Vince uh, many of us knew each other. We actually met a couple of new people that we had heard of, but we had never met because we never all assembled this many people together. And yeah. it, was, it was a wonderful celebration of a wonderful life and somebody who connected all of us um, at a very base level. And it was a very right. comfortable feeling. You know, um, I, I think uh, Vince is a great icon for uh, celebrating Act Two. Here he lived to 90, mm -hmm. active practically till the day he died. Yeah. Um, a great teacher, great people person, uh, useful, made himself useful to thousands by teaching Tai Chi. But he was also, he enjoyed life. He, he was a fun guy, great sense of humor. Um, and I think that's what we're trying to do with Celebrating Act Two is present people like that of any age. You, know? right. you don't have to be in your 80s. Uh, to be a good example for the rest of us. Uh, so, you know, when you and I interview all these people that we meet left, right, and sideways around the country, um, we're looking for people who are anywhere over 50 or just enjoying their second act and have something to share with the rest of us. And Vince certainly had a lot of that. You betcha. Yeah. So God bless him. May he rest in peace. I, uh, I think he's probably doing Tai Chi in heaven. <laughs> sure that. Yeah, and I, I hope everybody gets to watch uh, his videos. Uh, there's a lot of them on our website and on our YouTube channel. So um, some are him literally just describing the, uh, what do you call a move? Uh, a, well, a some form. of the moves are uh, one of, probably the, uh, the most complete set of him doing an instruction is uh, something called the shibashi or the warm-ups. And he explains oh, okay. there are 18 individual moves and he explains each one in yeah. detail what the value of that is to uh yeah i found that very useful hmm. yeah but also a couple of videos about uh, him talking and explaining his life and yeah. the class and all that stuff so god may he rest in peace and um and by the way if anybody has a vince mccullough in their life celebrate it yeah to share it with us let us know who they are so we can uh we can share it with the rest of the world well, thank you, John. It was a it was a fun time. Thanks for uh, bringing it up uh, uh, for me to be able to share my thoughts. And uh, I love them. I miss him. And uh, but he'll always be a part of my life. And uh, I only wish for everybody in our audience that you have one or more people like that who've affected you deeply. Right. And we'll see you all soon. Thanks. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life.